So we've touched upon your mm -hmm. um, experiences um, about how to move into industry and how you got to where you are. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, your most recent role was Chief Medical Officer over at Cochlear, um, very senior role within a very reputable business. So my first question to you would be, um, what would you say your greatest accomplishment was as a Chief Medical Officer? Yeah, look, good question. I, uh, you know, I've thought about this quite a lot. You know, by, by far and away, you know, the, the greatest satisfaction I get is from seeing people in my team <clears throat> take the opportunity to, to lead, uh, to make decisions, uh, to take responsibility and accountability. Mm -hmm. And I think in doing that, um, they develop their careers uh, and their professional lives you know, flourish. So to flip that yep. question, um, yep. with regards to accomplishments, what would you say was your biggest challenge as a Chief Medical Officer? Oh look, I think uh, you know the greatest challenge or the greatest disappointment I've seen in, in my time has been um, when I've been working uh, for a company that had a, a world leading therapy, uh, very powerful therapy uh, for, for, for liver cancer. Um, I had seen it work, I'd seen it work for years and we had a large scale clinical program but not all of those large trials developed uh, and delivered the results that we were expecting. Uh, so really, you know, so, so when you have a failed clinical trial, um, that can be a major setback. And, um, you know, it just goes to show that uh, great science is, uh, is sometimes difficult to achieve. So meticulous thought uh, to trial design, uh, trial execution, and uh, anticipating what you might get um, is absolutely critical. So I know as CMO you, you managed a lot of people, I know mm -hmm. it was a very large team. Mm -hmm. um, so ha I mean what would you describe as the top performing qualities um, your employees had and what made them you know perform so well? What were the yeah. top attributes? Look Joe, you know uh, very clearly to me uh, the folks who are the best performing are the ones who uh, really really enjoy their job. Uh, now you can't always uh, you can't always find that. That's a lifelong search for some people. The best people beyond uh, enjoying their role, I think, understand uh, the opportunity that the organisation is setting out to capture. Um, secondly, they understand and are bought into. So so they bought into, they own, they can talk to uh, the business strategy about how the business intends to capture. Uh, that opportunity, what the business aims to do about it, if you will. And then thirdly, I think the, the best performing folks uh, in the teams I've had the, the, the fortune to lead have known what their role in contributing to their part of the business strategy and, the, and its execution have been. Okay, and my final question mm -hmm. would be, how do you personally envisage the future of healthcare within Australia? Oh look, I think, um, again, at, at a macro level, uh, we've got an old old school economy. Uh, you hear it talked about a lot. Uh, our economy still is predicated on mining, oil, gas, agriculture. Um, yes, we export you know some uh, tertiary education to to other countries. But I think ultimately, if you think about um, the meaningful careers that our children and their grandchildren will have, we need um, more high margin, high growth businesses in this country. We need more uh, life sciences companies of the caliber of CSL and Cochlear and mm -hmm. ResMed and such. Um, they're the big three that always get referenced. Uh, we need um, another five, another 10, another 20 of those. And so I think uh, we've got a lot to, a lot to contribute uh, to those companies that are private, um, early stage companies or just listed on the Australian Stock Exchange. Mm -hmm. um, the expertise that we gain from those companies that I talked about or multinational pharmaceutical and device companies, we need to translate that into those small companies to, um, to grow those because they're the future. Sure. Okay. All right. Well, thanks for taking the time. My Appreciate absolute it. pleasure, Joe. Lovely, lovely to spend an afternoon chatting to you. As, right. as well as you. Cheers.